the last uh, recording has started. So, good evening, everyone. Uh, okay, so good evening, everyone. A very warm welcome to all of you. I will be your host for today's uh, welcoming ceremony at Hikeveda Limited. Uh, so, for my intro, my name is Yashan Rupadhyay and I am from Mumbai, currently pursuing Masters in Information Technology at RJ College. I joined this organization in October 2022 as a full stack web intern and I am currently the senior intern uh, at Hackpada Limited and team leader for the full stack web development uh, group as well as the scrum uh, manager for daily scrum meeting. Uh, so uh, again to welcome those of you who have joined on 1st March 2020 for this internship. So now we will start the internship. Uh, okay so now uh, for the agenda of today's meeting, uh, first we will have a quick description on the company, uh, on the company, followed by the vision and mission, uh, then the key product and the services, followed by uh, key people in our organization, followed by market analysis and customer profile, such as what type of customer we are currently dealing with, and then we will have a brief discussion on team management system, and finally, uh, what are our future plans and goals. Okay, so about our company, uh, so Hackveda was uh, started somewhere around 2011. Uh, main goal of our company was to solve cyber security problems. Although we have been working uh, before 2020-11, earlier Hackveda was working under the brand name of VMDD Technologies, which was a different research development organization vendor for em embedded hardware uh, boards and various form of verification software. Initially, Hackveda was registered within VMDD Technologies as a, a product where the goal was to work on software for embedded uh, hardware and to solve cybersecurity problems. So, uh, so when we started, uh, so when the company started Hackveda by building, uh, so we started by building small level cybersecurity product during 2020, 11 and 12. Uh, we also started working toward the research in cybersecurity. During that point of time, uh, we worked with a lot of research organization where we have to make the researcher understand like what was the cybersecurity and what kind of products, uh, publication and things can be done in the cybersecurity domain. So followed by 2011 uh, and 2012, uh, we uh, like actively started working toward the research and we also started de uh, delivering uh, cyber security wo uh, workshops as well as uh, somewhere around 2014 and 15 company grew with respect to cyber security and finally in 2017 uh, company registered uh, as a vm delivery technology uh, uh, out of vm delivery technology uh, as a separate entity and then uh, the core mission was to work on cyber security problems, software development, research support, and workforce development. And uh, within one year of business, company got global and registered in Canada uh, in 2020-18. So uh, the uh, core competency uh, of our company lied in designing cyber security solution, software development, uh, re uh, re the research support, embedded system, and the workforce development. So now going to next slide, we have mission and mission, uh, the vision and mission. So uh, with that, uh, with that company's main mission is to solve research development and hiring problems. Company's vision is to build workforce pipeline between the institute and the industry. Our goal is to build the industry product and to share the experience. So how can you like contribute to uh, this mission of our company? Uh, so. Uh, it has been in industry for like uh, we have been in in this industry for like uh, ten plus year now, and we have built multiple product for various uh, client, and we would like to share this product with you, experience uh, so that you can get experience on how this product are built and uh, get experience and make uh, use of that creativity to enhance this product and uh, build next level uh, product uh, while working with us. So now moving on to next slide, that is key product. So uh, in key product, we have built many kind of projects uh, in uh, this year. So during this year, uh, the one of the like uh, core product that we have built are the body composition machine. It is a product that we manufacture. And then we have the paratrooper locator system. It is again the product that we manufacture, uh, but uh, 
the parrot trooper uh, system uh, we actually supply it to adrd agra which is a defense and research organization we have worked on it for more than five in a uh, five year and again uh, for moving on we have made ai blood report manager project uh, which is very important project for, uh, so we made use of the ai and uh, nlp technology where our system extract data from report and analyze them uh, to find anomalies and recommend proper medication and home remedies uh, also uh, make easier for doctors and researchers to find and analyze anomalies in the report it is currently uh, being used by various diagnostic lab and uh, various researchers so uh, next is heart heart fitness app so it is used to measure heart health uh, heart health of a user it is used by sport person and sport coaches to like uh, so they can get more insight on a like uh, uh, user's heart rate because it is uh, very important uh, to have a proper heart rate while doing a exercise uh, so uh, it is like uh, you uh, used by most of the sport person and the uh, sport institutes. So Hackweather also is a Pearson View Test Center. So we have more than three thousand plus uh, exam conducted, uh, three thousand plus international exam conducted. So exams like Microsoft M M and Amazon, they are actually the client and they uh, request their exams to, to be conducted at our Pearson View Test Center. Apart from uh, this, we also have more than 3,500 various clients who make use of our Pearson View Test Center. And then uh, we also have algorithmic trading system. Uh, so we make use of algorithmic trading system to analyze the stocks and find like which stock will drop and how much it will drop. So uh, we generate uh, various algorithms to find out this anomalies in the uh, in the stock price. Uh, so we make use of machine learning technology such as stock price prediction and various other. It is also one of the project that you while uh, you guys will get to experience during this uh, presentation. Apart from this, we have also worked toward va uh, various machine learning, deep learning, and other uh, technologies such as DevOps and cloud. So kind of organization that uh, we provide uh, this kind of product majorly hack with provide this uh, uh, this project to like uh, institutes like drdo and uh, which take upon like 33.3 percent of the the entire market share and our work also contribute toward the health the healthcare followed by the research and uh, by the research that is 16.7 percent and uh, majorly we do research on uh, machine learning and deep learning uh, and cyber security and the network simulation and various paper and uh, new patent has been published for researcher uh, and we are also exp uh, like expanding our scope of research uh, as of now so uh, next up again taking 16.7 percent toward the professional courses up to uh, so up to 2020-14 and 15 we had like lot of uh, professional courses but uh, post that we have reduced the amount of pro professional courses that we make and currently we focus on training the res uh, the researcher faculty industries and works uh, and workshop around like um, around the various companies and then uh, taking up 8.5 percent is uh, focused on the internship to create the uh, skilled workforce for the uh, various clients so now uh, moving on, uh, we will focus on uh, what are our services, uh, what are the core services that we focus on. So uh, one of the primary services is uh, software development uh, and hardware development for our clients such as DRDO, uh, uh, such as uh, like uh, we have worked for scientific uh, analysis group that is SAG of DRDO. Apart from that, we are also working with like laser science technologies uh, group. We are also working with the CF, uh, CFS that is center for the fire and, expl and explosive apart from that we are also working in in the healthcare segment with uh, respect to Django and PHP web apps uh, we are also uh, working on Android and smart uh, and Wear OS smart watch application and now uh, you will be given opportunity to learn and get experience on this industrial product how they are built and you will also learn how it was built from scratch 
apart from that uh, we will also provide you with uh, like uh, necessary references that you will need and work uh, workflow on uh, how it was built now it was uh, now it was like uh, how it was being deployed on the server and how it is being managed on the cloud and how it was tested followed by we also have uh, we will also work toward the we also work toward the education system, uh, education so some of the like projects that we have done in this scope are like assessment test creation so we create assessment tests for various organization that are being conducted in a peers and view test center and then we also do simulation and secondly, uh, we are working toward the research support. So currently, our main uh, scope of research are uh, machine learning, deep learning, cybersecurity, and network simulation. And we are also expanding our scope of research as of now. So uh, moving on, as I said, we are authorized Pearson View Test Center. Uh, so we conduct a lot of exam for organization like Amazon and uh, like various other uh, big organizations such as Microsoft, IIT, Triple IT, and ITs, etc. We are also like uh, we also develop uh, assessment exam for this kind of organization. There are multiple organization who uh, ask to ask us to like create their as exam as uh, assistant. So finally. Uh, we have internship and professional courses. So we conduct offline and online internship as well as like other self-learning professional courses with the uh, live mentor during uh, like this internship. If needed, we may also like share this courses with you. Uh, we also conduct a lot of uh, workshops. Currently, software testing is one of the ongoing courses that we uh, that we can currently provide you with. So moving on uh, to the key people of our organization. So uh, the key people uh, of our organization, first we have Mr. Devanshu Shukla. Uh, he is the co-founder co and executive CEO of our or, of our Hackweather Limited. Uh, he also looks over the technical aspect of our hack, of Hackweather and he also is responsible for the technical operation and the projects in Hackweather. Then we have very respected Mr. Vijay Kumar Shukla. Uh, he is retired wing commander of Indian, Ar Indian Air Force. Uh, he is also co-founder and director. He also looks over the operation. We also uh, he is also owner of VMDD Technologies back in 2008. Followed by we have Miss Neha Avasti. She is co-founder and director of Human Research uh, re Research Team. Uh, she has five plus experience in building e-commerce platform in Python and Django. Uh, she looks over the technical aspect and training new interns. Then uh, we have Mr. Sumit Dhamma, co-founder of Hackweather Canada office. Uh, he stays in Canada and looks after the Canada Canada branch. And as of now, he is also wo uh, working with Amazon. And earlier, he was working with American Express. So you all be, will be working closely with the, uh, like Mr. Devanshu Shukla and Ms. Neha during this internship, as well as other team members and team leader of Hackweather Limited. So now, uh, moving on, we have market share of Hackweather Limited. So uh, since uh, like uh, IT market uh, I, in the IT sector, uh, the market is like two huge. Uh, so we have uh, like separated our workflows in five segments. So uh, if it is with respect uh, with respect to like any uh, technology. So it doesn't matter with technology. It is be it like uh, cyber security or any other technologies uh, you can think about. So we, uh, when uh, so in market uh, research, we first. Uh, like train people that takes like a little less but we always train people we develop assessment assessment test so for example uh, let's take cyber security as an example so we first train people on like uh, cyber security then we develop assessment test for cyber security then uh, we research on the various technologies related to cyber security we also develop software and like different technologies based on like cyber security like uh, the uh, software that can be given to clients and then we uh, like most of our product are like delivered to drdu and various decent uh, defense research organization we uh, so we work in this five segment with respect to any technology that you can think of so fo followed by we will look at the customer profile so looking at customer profile uh, as i told you drdu is one of our uh, our like uh, defense research uh, organization is one of our main vendors so uh, we main client so we are working with scientific analysis group the sag then we are working with uh, laser science technology uh, and as well as like center for uh, research fire ex uh, explosives that is uh, fis and then uh, for de uh, department of education we recently worked 
work from uh, work from this during the 2021 and 22 so um, we were like uh, we delivered uh, like samagra shiksha abhiyan uh, we have delivered this program for around 15 lakh student uh, in the delhi ncr region for class 9 to 12 standard and around uh, uh, 1500 government school participated in this uh, like program uh, we have educated them on cyber security this program was mainly focused on teenagers as you as you know teenagers are exposed to technology from young age so it is important to spread awareness to them uh, so we worked with like various department of education various ips officers and other uh, other like key people in department of education to conduct these programs on the various levels and then uh, some of the videos are uh, are available related to Samagra Shisha Abhiyan uh, in the YouTube in our YouTube channel. So you guys can like uh, go through them if you want. And apart from them, we also worked for the Ministry of Home Affairs. We worked on uh, or worked on like uh, uh, projects such as sentiment analysis for them. So up next, uh, then we have the healthcare uh, sector. So one of our main uh, like uh, customer profile in health healthcare sectors are like uh, researchers and doctors and the sport coaches, the dietitian. So uh, we have many projects related to healthcare. So such as blood report that we saw earlier. So in blood report manager, uh, and then we have the heart fitness app, and also we have that uh, other TM diet application. So in TM diet application, uh, we recommend diet to its user based on like uh, what their previous uh, like uh, score was. So coming to like uh, research, the next segment, we have like uh, uh, PhD scholars uh, who uh, we help them uh, to achieve their PhDs uh, with respect to the technical aspect. We also work with like various industries and institutions uh, to like uh, provide uh, them with uh, skilled workforce and conduct assessment test. Uh, so uh, then is to give them like experience on how things are working uh, on working in corporate environment and lot of you are joining don't have like any experience and some of you are like uh, uh, make have like a little experience some of you have only done like a couple of projects one or two projects some of you may even not have done any kind of group project so uh, this inter with this internship you will have like a uh, we will be given an uh, opportunity to work in this area and get like work experience on industry and products and get experience on this time. So uh, next time, uh, next us, uh, we have like uh, the team management system. So this is very important. So team manage, uh, when I talk about the team management system, so in team management system, we uh, make use of Trello and the Gmail. So a uh, lot of you, uh, may have received this email that is intern activation. This is really important. So I will also uh, like uh, uh, speak in Hindi uh, that uh, this So you have to look at it carefully. So all of you who have registered uh, and who have joined today, so you guys will be receiving this email that is intern activation email. So in this intern activation email, you will get that your intern status is now active. So what does it mean? So when you receive this email from that time onward, you will be an active inward uh, active uh, intern in the Hackweather Limited. Okay. Uh, so, but may uh, many of you may not have received the email. So you will get this re uh, email uh, like in next 24 to 48 hours. If you didn't receive this email, then you have to like join tomorrow and join on Friday and let us know that you have not received this email. So like this is very important. Yeah, make sure that uh, yeah, you get this email. Then uh, followed by we have this uh, task allotment feature. So when you will receive your like uh, task, uh, uh, your uh, internship activation email, after that you will receive your task allotment. That is you will get this in like uh, after your task uh, like activation, you will get it in like 24 to 48 hours, you will get your task. So in this task allotment email, uh, email yeah, there will be your name and it will uh, say task allotted and then the name of the task. So, uh, and then in the mail, there will be project name, the, what project you need to do during this internship and then the, the, your task name. So what is your task number one? And then uh, in the task description, there will be a detailed introduction on what your task is. You have to read it carefully. You have to understand what is the client requirement and followed by that, uh, we will also like provide you with the task reference. As you can see in the very bottom, there is a task reference. Uh, we have provided uh, with like any kind of task reference that uh, we can provide you with. 
some of these are like guided you will get like uh, you just need to follow the task reference but some of it you are not guided you will only get the reference and you have to create them on your own so now moving on uh, on every day you will receive your attendance marking mail so you will receive an email on your registered uh, email address the mail, the same email address that you have used to like uh, have your like uh, this assessment exam done and if you have joined from the direct uh, like registration then the same email you have used for uh, to make the payment so uh, in attendance marking after uh, you will only receive this when you have received the in, uh, intern activation email and you will get this on like every monday to saturday in like uh, out of seven days you will receive it for the six days but uh, the this internship meeting will only be there for the tuesday to friday so you have to mark your attendance on monday to saturday so in this email first we have general progress and attendance so uh, in this you can see uh, it says that please update your progress uh, by or before 5 pm every day okay along with submission for review on trello with tag devanshu shukla uh, we like uh, we review progress update on trello daily between 10 am to 6 pm so it is important that you submit your work before 5 pm so that we can uh, access it uh, before 6 pm and mark your attendance accordingly so submission can be done uh, any of the following form so suppose you are in the like python team or full stack team or you are in like uh, any coding related team so you have to uh, provide your source code so you have to go on github uh, in github you have to create a public repo in public repo you will make uh, like all the uh, or you will push all of your daily work and then uh, send us your github e uh, email uh, or you can also zip your source code and provide it in the trello we will check your source code we will see that yes this person has done some kind of task and then we will mark your attendance from our side and then uh, suppose you are not from any coding browser, suppose you are fr from the cloud team or a DevOps team, then you have to create a video demonstration link or uh, like uh, your like project is running on cloud somewhere, then you have to provide those links. So you have to create a video demonstration explaining like what you did today and then paste the link uh, and or like necessary screenshots in the Trello itself and make sure all the links are accessible. They are public so that anyone can uh, look at it. They are not like any uh, logged links though that we have to ask for your permission to like give us access and then we can uh, check your progress update. Uh, and then uh, after you have posted your progress on the Trello, you have to click on mark attendance. Uh, so this mark attendance will ensure that your internship status is active. When your internship status is active, only then you will receive this mail uh, like for attendance. If your internship status in on leave or like absent, you will not receive this mail. So make sure you are doing that. So you have to click on mark and uh, mark attendance button every day. And then you have to give your progress update on Trello every day. Now, moving on, uh, we have task and presentation. So as I said, you will receive your task allotment email when you will receive your task allotment email after you are like uh, done with the activation process so after activation you will receive your task email so now how, what to do with the task we know that uh, you need to progress update of your task every day but uh, again so suppose you are getting some kind of technical issues during your task so what you have to do is you have to create a, a simple video recording explaining what your error was and where you are getting that error and post it in trello you can tag add the Devanshu Shukla and, or your team leader in the comment, uh, what uh, like comment you will be making so that we can assign you a technical support and get your issue sorted. Okay. Uh, but your attendance will be masked. Is, suppose your uh, error is valid error. Yes, we know that this error is good and uh, you can't like find it with like simple Google search. Then we will help you and we will mark your attendance from our side. Uh, but you do not need to join this scrum meeting. See, this scrum meeting is a common scrum meeting. You will always join this scrum meeting every time you need to join any kind of meeting. Okay. If there is like different meeting going on, you will receive that uh, meeting link. But for like common meeting, everyday meeting, this is the meeting link that you have to join. So uh, to ask your general queries or for your presentation. Uh, so, uh, but you don't need to join this meeting. If you are getting error, you just need to post it in Trello. Your errors will be solved in 24 to 48 hours. We will ask one of our like team members to connect with you. He can connect with you with his, by the various format. He can like uh, directly answer you on the Trello or he can like call you 
or he will like to send you an email. So make sure that you are checking your emails every day. Uh, make sure that you have marked hack weather limited as important. So uh, there are currently two most active email that is admin at the rate hack weather and the director active at the rate hack weather dot in. Make sure that you have uh, marked director at the rate hack weather dot in as important. And an email you are getting from hack weather is marked as important so that you don't miss any of your emails. So. Uh, after that, uh, he can also like ask you to like give his, uh, your uh, laptop or desktops remote access so that he can solve your query. And again, uh, suppose your task is now completed. So uh, when your task is completed, you will post it in Trello. So how you will post it in Trello? You will create a video of like explaining what your task was, how you completed it. And that completed task, like whatever the source code is, or if the running link is needed, then provide the running link. Or uh, you can also create a demo and provide it in the uh, Trello. After that, you have to click on assign new task. Make sure that you are not clicking the assign new task just to like uh, out of curiosity to check what it, this button does because there is no confirmation page. Once you like click on assign new task, there uh, you will have uh, like consequences to face because uh, we don't want to like uh, have a request that uh, have like nothing to do with the new task. Only click on this when you want new task. And then, uh, so uh, suppose now your task is done, you have provided it, then you have to create like a presentation uh, of your what your task was you have to create it and then uh, you have to create the pitch and deck that is like what you will speak during your presentation and then a small video recording of like uh, uh, your presentation your ppt file and uh, like what your demo is so whatever task is there there has to be some kind of demo so you will give that include that demo in the presentation itself uh, then your presentation you will uh, will be re uh, reviewed you may or may not get like uh, a mail for uh, evaluation mark, but uh, uh, like you, uh, if your uh, like presentation is really good, then we will ask you to come in this internship scrum meeting and present it in front of everyone. Okay, uh, and uh, this after presenting in this scrum meeting, you will definitely receive a evaluation score that will be like uh, really useful if you want to get paid internship. Uh, so uh, when you have like uploaded the PPT meeting uh, link in the Trello, you have to look and schedule presentation. That is uh, when we will know that you have uploaded some kinds of demo or PPT in the Trello. And then we will check that uh, demo or PPT. And then we will let you know if it is good enough to be in the presentation. Okay. Uh, so now uh, moving on, we have progress update on Trello. So how you will do your progress update. So in the email, in the task email itself, you will receive like multiple links. So first will be your task reference. You can see in the middle of my screen, there is task reference. Uh, if there are like multiple task reference, you will receive multiple links. If there are like multiple instruction given for your task, you will also receive su such as like task instruction. You will have to go to the task instruction and then follow them to complete your task. And then uh, he, it says update your daily progress on Trello here which means uh, you have to click on this link by click on on this link you will be like redirected to the trello website uh, in there you have to create a new account for your trello and then uh, you will have to pro progress update on this card itself so it's a slash three for discussion so this person whatever this person has received he will update like his progress in for discussion card in like whatever uh, group he belongs to if you like do not have any access to like a Trello link, uh, like you don't have this Trello link uh, or like uh, for some reason, this Trello link is not working, then you can uh, join your group bro. Uh, you will also receive this email regardless if it is working or not working because this is your main group board. So if you are from the full stack web development tool, you will have to join this group, uh, join this board so that you will get access to like, uh, and you will get to connect with all the members of full stack web development group. And if you are like from the Python group or devops group or design group or any group you will have to join that group board and you will so that you can connect with your team members and then if you do not have access to common board in this common board we have the important rules and regulation uh, based on like what to do and what not to do uh, they will be posted by tomorrow you will have to uh, go through all the rules and regulation make sure that you follow them 
uh, because if you don't follow them then you will be gain like mo at most three warning you will gain first warning second warning on third warning if you are not following the rules and regulation you will be removed out of your uh, internship on the next morning you will receive your termination letter so make sure that you are following the rules and regulation that will be posted tomorrow in the common board and all of you are joining with the common board you will get to uh, you will get access and get to like connect with all the interns in this hack weather limited not just uh, like limited to your domain or your group you will get to connect with all the interns in hack weather limited so now moving on uh, how to request for like new task and schedule presentation i have already explained it but uh, moving on again when your present like task is done you have to post it in trello under 40 uh, like 48 hours or 24 hours your task will be reviewed and then you will receive the new task email in the new task email you will get uh, what your new task is sometimes you may get like two tasks but don't uh, panic uh, only thing that we want is the uh, the thing is uh, many people like uh, are all like they are sometimes busy and they want leave so they can take leave but uh, we have uh, like some kind of deadline you have to complete your task in that de deadline if you don't complete your task in that deadline then you will receive negative evaluation so uh, make sure that you are completing your task but if like you are getting some kind of error as i said previously then uh, we understand that you get error and your de uh, deadlines can be relaxed but uh, that is only when you have like a valid reason okay so make uh, we are not asking you to join this meeting every day you just have to post your daily progress on the trello and click on mark attendance in the email address that is it that's all we ask you to do uh, but you have to do it on daily basis uh, make sure that you are not skipping any day uh, then you will receive like your negative evaluation points make sure that you have 80 percent evaluation point that is only uh, we can like provide you with the internship completion certificate and you can get the easily get the 80 percent evaluation if you have done one presentation with like more than 88 marks out of 110 and you are posting your progress update on the daily basis by following the right format and the right format is to like uh, uh, explain what you did today what your task was and then give some kind of like way to verify that you have done your task that is by adding a source code or like by adding a screenshot or a video second of when you have like uh, your task like you have uh, your ta you have clicked on assign new task then you will create a presentation of that task and then you will click on schedule presentation so by clicking on schedule presentation you will go for the presentation and you uh, if it is good enough you will be asked to uh, do the presentation here now uh, as i said it is like uh, we act, we know that uh, you need like some kind of leave then you can always take the leave uh, so to apply for leave you have to go to common board in common board there is card for the like uh, pro, uh, daily progress update you have to click on it and then you have to like uh, explain why you want to uh, get that like uh, uh, why you want to get the uh, like leave if it is really personal uh, then uh, not an issue uh, we understand uh, so uh, you can like uh, just say that i have some personal reason and this is why i want leave but very very important you need to uh, like uh, provide your email address and provide your trello handle so that we can mark your status as leave once you have your status as leave you will not receive uh, this daily attendance email and when you come back go to trello in common board you have to like uh, tell us like uh, you are back and now change your status to active then uh, within 24 to 48 hours we will change your status to active and you will start receiving your emails on daily basis so now after your internship completion is done we will check that uh, your evaluation is more than 80 percent and then uh, in trello you have to provide your full name email and then start duration and the end duration the project and task that you have completed during your uh, internship and then you uh, uh, your uh, completion letter will be issued uh, with uh, for that you also don't need to join the scrum meeting you will just post it in trello uh, and now i will come to like what is trello after this uh, like a uh, couple more slides so now when you have like clicked on schedule presentation you have clicked on assign new task and you have clicked on schedule presentation so then you will receive this kind of email in this email uh, like um, you will get that your uh, like presentation uh, is scheduled on 1st february 2023 at 7 pm and then what is the name of your presentation the details will be specified 
but you should know because it is your task and it is your responsibility to have proper task introduction and then what is your date of presentation and the timing of presentation and then uh, so uh, after your presentation is done you will receive this evaluation score email in this evaluation score email you will like uh, get presentation title and then what your presentation what presentation title you have given and then the uh, presentation score so it is uh, scored out of 110 for 80 percent you have to get 88 percent and then you will receive a feedback like uh, how your presentation was uh, was it good or bad uh, so uh, there are some kind of parameter that we focus on like uh, scoring your evaluation. So uh, I will cover everything. So for your presentation, coming to first of all for your presentation. So there uh, has to be a hook and uh, hook and story. What is a hook and story? So there has to be some kind of like uh, the format that your presentation follows. Uh, it should be consistent. It should not ha like have a random topics pop up anytime. So make sure that you are uh, making a good PPT. The design is good. It is like uh, easily uh, like visible. People can see the, what you are uh, trying, where you are trying to point it. And then uh, make sure that uh, you are communicating with, uh, with your uh, fellow team members that will be also evaluated. Uh, make sure that you are uh, uh, like uh, following the question and answer uh, at the end uh, so that uh, it will be also uh, a scoring factor for your presentation. Uh, there has to be good ending for the presentation. There has to be demonstration for your task. The camera should be good. The mic should be good. The and the background image. Uh, the background image is nothing but your environment. Make sure that you are in a right environment. You are not like somewhere uh, in a train or bus. Make sure that you are at your home or somewhere like a uh, uh, good place uh, that uh, so that uh, there is no disruption. And then make sure that your internet is good. Uh, there is no lag because uh, if it is lagging, then what's the point of giving the uh, the presentation? And uh, so uh, again. So for scoring, there are other factors. So suppose there is only demonstration. Your task doesn't like have much to do with the uh, PPT. Then uh, we can remove this who can story thing, but there has to be step-by-step -step explanation of your task. All the steps you have taken from the client requirement to how you have like assessed that client requirement based on that client requirement, how you have like uh, managed the project, how you have like uh, uh, all the uh, how you have like what tools you have used and where you have used those tool and like what was the uh, the contribution of your team member in your project and everything this has to be included if it is demo based presentation and based on that uh, just a general factor uh, during this presentation you will have some rules and regulation that you need to follow make sure that you are following them or else you will receive negative evaluation now coming to what is trello so uh, make sure th uh, that my screen is uh, visible. I will just touch it. Okay, so my screen is visible. So in this uh, screen, you can see we have common board. It says common board. So uh, in the email, you can see that uh, when the task was assigned, so uh, you will receive this link, update your daily progress on Trello here. You will have to click on this link. You will be redirected to the Trello website. In Trello website, you will you can create a free account. It is completely free. You don't have to pay anything. So uh, you, after creating the account, you will be redirected to this page or something like this. But you have to navigate and find uh, where it says like yes, common yes. word or like web developer group, whatever it is, whatever group you belong to. Or suppose like uh, if you belong to like some other group, then make sure that you are on that group. So in this common board uh, for the Trello, uh, some of you are asking what is Trello. So uh, this is the Trello board. In this we have like rules and re uh, rules and record. So there are like completely only record of presentation. Rules will be added by tomorrow morning. You will have to read through those rules. You have to follow those rules and make sure that you are not like breaking any kind of rules then uh, because if you break any rule you will get negative evaluation and if your evaluation is not like more than 80 percent you will not receive your internship completion certificate okay so now uh, this meeting is being recorded and all the meetings are being recorded they will be provided in the internship meeting recording card it, uh, whether it will be like common board or your like uh, web developer uh, so i am the team leader of web developer group so of course i have access to web developer group so in this web developer group, uh, you can see uh, again, we have a meeting recording link. 
so in all the groups we will see that there are meeting recording rings so make sure that uh, if you if you like uh, want to see the meetings after you couldn't like uh, attend the meetings and if you would like to uh, get them then this is the only card and only way to uh, like get this meeting we upload the meetings on uh, youtube every day after the meeting is done but they are private and they are unlisted they are not public if you want to like access them you have to uh, go to this card uh, and then you have to click on this meetings meeting link so uh, suppose uh, earlier meeting i have provided the link uh, this youtube link you have to click on it then you will be able to uh, like get uh, whatever your uh, meeting link was on whatever the previous day meeting you can access then uh, previously uh, so uh, we like introduce this attendance system like uh, in last couple of month uh, previously we used to have uh, everything manually done so uh, you can see there are like more than 70 uh, 1700 record for the attendance so right now this is like archived card you don't have to click on attendance record uh, only way to give your attendance is by uh, like posting your progress update you can see there are four people uh, after like 6 pm they have posted their progress uh, and then they have clicked on mark mark attendance in the email that is the only way to get your attendance so you don't have to click on it and then after every uh, presentation uh, so I, like I will ask you to give confrontation and encounter session. So that is suppose there is some problem in the PPT or some problem in the presentation that you would like to know the presenter. Uh, you would like to know, uh, you would like to tell the presenter like what their mistake was. You can put them in confrontation and encounter session. And then uh, there is uh, again a common operation card that you have to follow every day. There is progress update. So this progress update card is there to like uh, have your uh, leave application. So if you want to take leave, you can go to this progress update. So when you go to any card, not just this card, any card, there will be name of card. You, uh, you are not supposed to change this name of card and you are not supposed to add any kind of new card. So when I add any kind of new card, see these people have created their new card. So they will get a warning, they will get negative evaluation and uh, this card will be deleted and archived later on. Uh, but you are not supposed to like create this card. Uh, anytime you want to give your progress update, you have to click on this name progress update. Don't click on this pencil button, click on the progress update. The progress update card will open and then you can easily see there is name, there is member. You don't have anything to do with this. And then there are quick setting. Uh, this is only for the administrator, um, the moderator and admins. You don't have to like change any of this setting. In the description, you are not supposed to change it. Uh, if there are any attachment uh, like uh, in the description or like in the Trello board, you are not supposed to change or delete this attachment. They are like against the rules and regulation. So uh, there are checklists. You are not supposed to delete an item. We will add the checklist such as new task. If there are like new tasks, we will add them in checklist. There will be your uh, like uh, at, uh, date, deadline dates. And then you can see under activity, there is write a comment section. You have to click on write a comment. And then you have to click on add the rate. You have to click on Devanshu Shukla. So if you click on Devanshu Shukla, you, uh, you will have this like uh, uh, Trello handle. And you can also tag me for the full stack web development team. Those of you who have joined for the web development, you uh, you can tag me and the team leader. So you have to say uh, yes, Chandru Pade at the rate. That is my Trello handle. And then say that I want uh, leave my uh, I have some personal reasons. And then uh, you have to specify the date. So uh, say the start date is like uh, 1 March and then end date is uh, like 4 March and then you have to click on save then you, uh, this, message will, this message will go through and then we will know that you need to uh, mark a server but there are some people like uh, who don't have access to card uh, the, when uh, in the email itself uh, there are like cards uh, which you can't access uh, there can be some possibility 99% you will get to access but if for some reason you uh, you are not able to like uh, get those cards you can like uh, always uh, give your progress update in this uh, common board itself but for the sake of simplicity you have to give your progress update in your respective card itself but if you are not uh, able to like uh, access them then you can always give your progress update in this common board task then sir will be able to see what uh, what your uh, task was 
and make sure you are not doing this thing you are not creating a card and like uh, giving you progress update separately because they will be overlooked and your attendance will be marked as absent for that day so now coming to this uh, group uh, card so uh, in like a, uh, you are you will be like you know at least one of the group so always uh, i have this group link for the web developer group and you will also receive like a, a project group so if i just go to my trello board then uh, there will be a project group. suppose you are in a project then you will receive and if there is any separate board for the project then you will receive that link and you have to give a progress update in your respective project card itself so you can see i am currently like working on tm project so there is separate board for it and then uh, suppose i am working on like this tm hard website for visualization so i have to like uh, give my uh, progress update here so i have given pro progress update and sir will reply to it okay so uh, this is the procedure for giving your progress update i hope like uh, this clarified all the uh, like uh, problems you had with trello and uh, now moving on for your group uh, for your group card so, so when you like get your group card link you have to give your progress update in this group card or like if there is specifically any uh, like progress card specified so i hope that is clear with the trello uh, this is how your daily progress will be done and uh, if you have like uh, any issues with the trello you can like tell me tomorrow or on the friday so now uh, moving on So now moving on, we have future plan of our organization. Uh, so uh, new product develop. Uh, so like uh, it is to build new product. Uh, our company is like uh, striving toward building the new product for our organization, and then making the application market and building the skilled workforce for the new product. So now uh, like we have in uh, interns introduction session you will be notified when there is introduction intern introduction session so in this intern introduction what we want so from you what we want is uh, whenever there is your intern introduction session you will open your uh, camera and you will open your mic make sure that you are in a proper environment you are not getting disturbed by anyone and then uh, you will have to provide your full name your branch your year the college any professional certification if you have done any technical skill set you have and any expectation from this internship what does mean so suppose for a mock uh, for mock up if i want to give a give my intern introduction so what i will say is my name is Christian Rupadhe and i am from masters uh, currently pursuing information technology and from like uh, rj college i am in final year I haven't done any professional certificate, uh, but uh, I have done some Udemy courses on like full stack web development and the Merlin, uh, Merlin uh, slot. And then uh, if you have like any kind of uh, professional certification and award apl application, if you have, then you can certainly like tell us. Uh, for the like technical skill set, if you have, uh, suppose my technical skill set are uh, HTML, CSS, JavaScript, PHP, ChatJS, libraries. So you can tell them and then any expectation from the internship. So it will like hardly take 30 seconds to one minute and then you will have to, uh, it, it, you will move on to next person because there are like more than 100 participants. Uh, it is not possible to have a detailed discussion with each and every participant. Oh, okay. Okay, so now to conclude this uh, presentation, so I would like to like uh, uh, again have a small recap of what we discussed. So uh, we saw like company profile and then we uh, like uh, saw the intern management system. In the intern management system, there are like uh, some key points to be noted. First of all, like this meeting is a common meeting uh, and anytime like you are having any kind of meeting, you will have to like join this meeting. There are no other link. If there are any other meeting links that you are told to join, then you will you will get the link and you will only join that link if you are told to join that link. Okay. And then for the task, you will receive the activation email. Make sure that you are receiving your activation email. If you are not receiving, receiving your activation email, make sure like you tell us by coming in this meeting, you have to post your email in the chat box. Uh, if you didn't get the activation, email, don't post, post it right now. Uh, wait for like 24 to 48 hours. By a Friday, if you didn't receive the activation email, uh, please let us know. And uh, same can be said for the task email. You will receive your task email after your activation is done. 
and then uh, so uh, I got this. So intern introduction is like organized tomorrow, seven p.m. Uh, that is again important thing. Make sure that uh, you have like thirty second to one minute uh, to give this uh, to have your introduction done. Make sure that you are in a correct environment. Followed by after your like uh, task is done, uh, you can like always click on assign new task. You will be assigned new task, and you have to click on schedule a presentation every time your task is done. And then on success, uh, on success, uh, you will receive your evaluation point. Uh, but these are subject to change. Uh, some of these features can change because we are currently working on building a like proper uh, intern management system. Uh, there are some patches need to be done. They can be changed. When they are changed, you will be notified. Um, and uh, if they are changed, you will be notified by like uh, email or by Trello. So make sure that you always check your email each and every day from this day onward and make sure that you are also actively available on Trello itself. So uh, I believe we are not having any question answer session today uh, because of like time limitation. But from tomorrow onward, when you are having your intern introduction, uh, you can, uh, please feel free to like uh, give your uh, this uh, in introduction and you can also ask your question and uh, make sure if you didn't receive your intern activation mail tomorrow, please let us know. Okay, with this, I would like to conclude this. Uh, presentation thank you for uh, like uh, giving us your valuable time and from tomorrow onward you will be proper, uh, properly uh, treated as a uh, hack with the intern so i will stop the presentation for now okay so as the uh, sir has put in the chat inter, uh, interns uh, introduction is organized tomorrow at 7 pm on the same meeting link as today so the, uh, you have to like uh, join with this scrum meeting that you have received in your email. Make sure to bookmark it and always join in this meeting. Okay. Okay, so intern activation mail is already sent to all intern on the like 1st March. Make sure like uh, you are uh, having it. So, uh, uh, yes, ma'am. Would you like to add something? No. Uh, yeah. Hi. Thank you. Yes. Uh, so yes, uh, tomorrow, seven o'clock, you guys will be having your interns introduction. So the interns introduction format is already shared in the meeting. Uh, uh, tomorrow also, it will be guided. Uh, it will be shared on screen so that you guys can follow and you can uh, give your introduction. The intern introduction will be recorded and will be uh, kept for future references as well. Also, interns activation mails are sent today for all the interns. Anybody who may not have received an interns activation mail today, kindly check if you have provided the correct email IDs. Okay. Otherwise, you can reach out to us on director at hackveda.in. Here is the email. Director at Hackweda. You can write an email to director at hackweda.in in case if you uh, you have not received activation mail. Okay, this activation mail is important because only the active candidates will receive progress update emails and the task emails. Okay, till the time you are taking this internship, you have to be active. If you are on leave. You can inform us again on director at hackweather.in or your respective project progress update card on Trello. So anywhere you can inform us if you are going for a leave, inform us so that we can mark your status on leave so that you won't be troubled with the n number of mails which is being broadcasted daily by the system. Okay. The process. Uh, which is explained in this internship introduction meeting is very important because 95% of the processes are done uh, with a system. The system is doing it. So if you will follow, you will be able to access all the information and you will be able to make most out of the internship. If you will not follow the system, if you will try to reach out on WhatsApp or any other mediums, you might not get good support uh, for this internship. So make sure you are communicating with us on Trello on the respective task Trello card or on email director at hackpina.in. These are the only two points of communication for all the interns, irrespective of their batches. Okay. 
in the morning every morning uh, so tomorrow you have your introduction post your introduction or pre your introduction you will get the task emails also in your task email you will get the description you will get the instructions what you need to do we also provide self learning material as well so that you can understand the technology and then you can start working on task okay do not get confused with uh, that a task uh, is something you know where you need to have certain prerequisites it's not going to be like that when your beginner level tasks will be allotted which will be either tomorrow or day after tomorrow certain references will be given along with the task given okay so that you can read those references make a basic understanding and then proceed with the task okay uh, just give me a minute guys ma okay so i believe this is clear uh, now followed by uh, so i was uh, just taking you from the back follow the process uh, which will be communicated to you via email 99% of the communication is done with the email id director at hackweather.in okay and uh, you also have to communicate on either trello with respect to your task allotment so that you can work in a group wise manner and in case if there is any issue you are unable to uh, you know get the emails or if you are facing any operational issue do let us know on director at hackweather.in so that we can solve your problem okay apart from that when you tag me at devanshu shukla there is a support uh, team which is being set up so uh, support team is uh, handled by ankush sharma he will be taking care of responding to your queries and taking your project reviews so he is appointed today onwards on that role and responsibility so he'll be taking care of reviewing your progress and uh, scoring them as well as final scores will be given on the basis of presentation which you will be doing okay uh those people those who are asking for introduction format it is already being discussed in the meeting if you have not seen it uh, properly tomorrow it will be shared on screen okay also an email invitation has been sent today which includes a meeting link and in that meeting link if you go to um, end of the meeting around 10 to 15 minutes uh, you know uh, pre ending the meet so you will find the inter interns introduction format okay also we will communicate introduction format on your email by tomorrow before this meeting happens okay so i believe this is clear so you guys are clear with uh, your activation second to activation is your introduction meeting where you have to introduce yourself on the introduction format format we will circulate again on email today on to all those interns who are activated after your introduction meeting you will receive in the morning tomorrow you will receive a progress update email you can just mark attendance okay do not mark assign new task do not mark schedule presentation because you don't have a task as of now okay in the morning somewhere from between 9 am to 11 am you will receive a progress update and attendance marking mail so you just click on mark attendance so that your attendance is marked okay up next to attendance marking you will get uh, a task email in the task email your project name task name description instructions references link of the trello card where you have to update your progress group invite trello invite and common board invite will be sent okay this common board invite and group invite is sent along with all the tasks okay so whatever task is allotted to you you will get the respective trello invite for the task and for the and you will also get the trello card link where you have to update your progress regularly okay also one very very important thing i want to convey you have to be available from monday to saturday that means progress update email and attendance marking email will come from monday to saturday and you have to mark yourself active each day okay at the end of the day we send an absent email so if you have not marked your present automatically you will be marked as absent by end of the day okay second uh, 
Okay, so uh, progress update email I have already told. Okay, um, there is one more thing which I wanted to convey. Uh, sorry, just missed that. Uh, just give me a minute, guys. Okay, uh, so uh, again, coming back to the point. So your attendance marking mails will be sent regularly from Monday to Saturday, where you have to mark your attendance. Okay, scrum meetings, which is this meeting which you have joined today. The meeting link will remain same up to the duration of your internship, whether it is two months, three months, four months, five months, or up to six months. Okay. This meeting link will remain same. This scrum meeting is organized daily, 7 p.m. to 8 p.m., 7 p.m. to 9 p.m. In fact, okay. Uh, and this is organized between Tuesday to Friday. Uh, I'm correcting myself, not regularly. It is organized between Tuesday to Friday only. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, every week, okay. But progress update mails will be sent to you from Monday to Saturday. So please don't get confused. Uh, attendance, you have to be available from Monday to Saturday, but scrum meetings are only organized between Tuesday to Friday. Okay. Not on Monday as well as not on Saturday and Sunday. So if you have, if you're facing any problems during your internship, you can join the scrum meeting and you can share your queries with your scrum manager as of now for this scrum, uh, Mr. Yash Chandropadhyay, he is taking care of the scrum meeting. He will be taking all your general queries. Okay. Post the presentations, which happens daily in the scrum meetings. He will take your general queries. And um, if he, uh, he will try to solve your general queries as in not the technical ones, the operational queries in case, if you are not receiving emails, if you are facing any issues, you, you know, if you have not received a task. So all that uh, issues can be handled in form of general queries in this scrum meeting. Other technical queries, you have to post it on your respective Trello card only. Okay. Because there are multiple groups. You belong to one technology group. Okay. There are certain number of people in that group. There will be support team members also on that group. So if you have any technical query with respect to your task, you upload, upda update that query within the Trello card itself. Okay. The support team will take care of your technical query. You need not bring your technical query in this scrum meeting. We do not handle or answer technical queries in this scrum meeting. This scrum meeting is only organized for the presentations, which are scheduled for the day followed by general operational queries. If anybody is facing any issues with the communication operations. Okay. As in, if the, if there is any issues with the management process. So for those, you can come to this meeting and join major idea of organizing this meeting from 7 PM to 9 PM is that what all team members are working, what all tasks and projects they're doing. They compile their presentations and they present in this meeting so that everybody gets a relevant experience of internship. They get to know what other teams are doing, what other people are working on within the organization. Okay. And the presentations are not only limited to interns presentations. Our team members also present. Okay. There are, uh, various kinds of presentations will happen. Technical presentations will happen. Presentations related to upcoming projects which we are going to have or uh, the future coming projects and the future uh, obligations we have, we will be discussing it here so that people get to know and we can shortlist talent uh, from here. So all that things will be done here. Also, uh, we have started this uh, process of bringing new, uh, generating new content. Okay. Depending on uh, what we do not have in the database as of now. So, uh, just to, just to correct myself, 
uh, since 2011, we have worked on various projects and we recorded a lot of material related to those projects. A lot of trainings also has been delivered since 2011 up to 2015, 16, 17. And the technology content which was delivered was very new at that point of time. And it was implemented in such a way that it is new as of today. Okay. So that content will be shared. But wherever we feel like that we now we need to have new content. So we will be organizing trainings as well. You won't be charged for those trainings. You will get access to those trainings without any cost. Our uh, industrial experts, maybe from Hackweda, maybe from other organizations, they will join those uh, sessions. They will conduct those sessions. You guys will gain experience out of those sessions. Uh, it will be conducted in form of trainings. Okay. Uh, and please mind it, it won't be organized for every particular technology because we already have a lot of content for different domains and disciplines of the internships. But we are starting uh, this series for a couple of new technologies, you know, uh, of which we do not have the data, the latest data or the data is uh, obsolete. Okay. So you will be informed accordingly. So the communication will be done with your with the emails with which you are registered on Hackweda, followed by once your tasks are allotted, follow the instructions as per the task and update your progress updates on Trello. Once your tasks are complete, okay, through progress update email, you can click on schedule presentation so that we get to know that now we need to review your completed task. Okay. So we will invite you to the scrum meeting. You will present we will give you scores. These scores are very, very valuable. Okay. Your internship probation completion letters, as well as internship completion letters will be issued on the basis of your presentations delivered in this scrum meeting. Okay. And it should be above 80%. So we score out of 110. The scoring will be explained to you in the upcoming meetings and upcoming sessions, as well as you will follow, you will see various presentations happening tomorrow or day after tomorrow onwards tomorrow since we have interns introduction so we might not have any presentations tomorrow but day after tomorrow that is friday definitely there will be presentations you guys are most welcome to join the scrum meeting and see the kind of presentations happening and how the scorings are being done how the feedbacks are being given okay depending on those scores there will be very uh, there will be two very important aspects one your internship probation completion letters and internship completion letters as well as your paid internship selection will be done on the basis of the presentations you guys are doing in this scrum meeting okay and that you can do on the basis of our invitation so you have to update it properly once we get to see your uh, ppt in a recorded format if we find it good then we will invite you to the scrum meeting and then you can present it live before that, you have to record your presentation and upload it on your Trello card so that we can review it. In this scrum meeting, we only will be inviting quality content so that it is a good experience for all the interns, those who are joining the meeting, all the interns, all the team members and all the important stakeholders. Okay. So this is how it is going to be recognized. Uh, this is how it is going to be organized. Uh, Followed by, if there is any query, you can have your general queries with Mr. Yash Chandra um, He will help you out. Uh, otherwise, he will let me know and I will help you guys out. Okay. So uh, now we are waiting for you guys tomorrow uh, to join this meeting again at 7 o'clock. Give your interns introduction so that we get to know you. Uh, because all my team members are very, very excited to have new team members joining in. As well as we want to know uh, from which college, which organizations you are, as well as uh, what new skills you are going to bring in to the organization. So we would be very, very happy uh, to meet you guys. Okay. So I advise you guys to be very well prepared for tomorrow. Uh, dress well, uh, make sure your camera, your audio uh, is working fine. Do test it with uh, Zoom. Make sure you are connecting with laptops. Do not try to join with mobile phones. It might have issues. Okay. So join with your laptop so that if anybody does not have a laptop, then it is, they can join with mobile, but make sure you have a good background. You are not in a noisy place. Your recordings are done in a better way because all that will be accounted and scored. And one 
of the major aspect is Hackweda will be hiring for our own projects as well as, you know, for our own services, whatever we are delivering. Apart from that, we do have a huge client base uh, who is hiring through our workforce platform. So we uh, have this responsibility to curate the intern talent and communicate that intern talent with the hiring partners also. So make sure you follow the processes. Make sure you, you build good content during this internship. Make sure you gain good and relevant experience. Okay. Because that's what is going to count. And there are various uh, high level good companies available uh, who, uh, first of all, we are trying to capture as many interns as we can. Okay. Those who might get left. Okay. Or those who might want to work with some other organizations. Definitely, they will be introduced with our hiring partners also. Your performance will be um, accounted. And if you are having a good, you know, uh, scoring level, depending on your attendance, depending on your progress updates, depending on the final presentation, final as in the task presentations, because after every task, you have a presentation. Okay. And there could be a number of tasks. It is not limited. The number of projects are also not limited. They could be one, two, three, four projects, depending on the kind of technology you have uh, been selected for. Okay. Whether you are coming in a direct registration mode or you're coming through assessment test modes, uh, from now on, the process will be common for everyone. All the rules, responsibilities, everything is common for everyone. Okay. So make sure you give your best effort in the internship, gain the relevant experience. If, uh, if we see that you guys are putting good efforts, definitely we will be exposing our confidential projects with you so that you can gain much more relevant experience out of the internship. Okay. Uh, most of the time, 99.9% uh, uh, in this internship, nothing will be charged from you any in any format, neither the course fees or anything else. Okay. Uh, this is for direct registrations as well as for... Uh, what do we say? Uh, the assessment people. Okay. Uh, the only thing is you have to work out on the tasks properly, make the submissions in a proper way. Okay. Because uh, there are various large projects on which the company is working and you might be working on smaller modules of it. Okay. So initially we want for the very first month, we want you guys to build up your beginner level skill. Uh, yeah, uh, so as, uh, to, you know, uh, making SRS documents of you know, various projects, understanding the software requirements, specifications of the projects. Okay. Uh, do that for the very first month, depending on whatever task is being allotted to you, followed by, you will be making your hands, uh, you know, uh, on with the technology and building various products. So initially we are interested to share those products, which we have already built so that you get the relevant experience. Okay. Once you are able to implement what we have already built, then we can add you to those teams where you can build what next we are going to build. Okay. Or what next the company is building. So you can contribute in that role. So this is what is going to happen in the internship. Uh, apart from that, every information is given to you by Mr. Yashchand Rupadhyay. He has already explained things very well. Apart from that, uh, the email invitation email, which is sent to you, it also has a recording. Uh, which we recorded in the previous uh, meeting, which was done on 16th February. Uh, I have explained each and every uh, point of internship process in that meeting. So I recommend open that email, go to that 16th February meeting and follow the instructions. Uh, you, you will get much clearer instructions on that meeting recording. Okay. So we are not going to circulate today's meeting recording. You can refer that meeting recording because it is already shared with you guys on email. Also, it is available on our Hackveda's YouTube channel, um, Hackveda official, uh, Hackveda limited. Also, you can search, you can go and subscribe it because majority of the content we are putting on our channel, though it is unlisted. Uh, but definitely if you are a subscriber, then you will get notified, uh, what all we are posting. Okay. As well as uh, there is one more important announcement, uh, the new sessions which we are recording or which uh, the industrial mentors are being, uh, being giving. So that will be recorded. You will get access to access the meetings. Okay. Uh, but the videos will be 
hosted in a members only mode okay so only the members will be able to access those sessions these scrum meeting recordings will be public this will be available in a common meeting this you can access any time as per your convenience you may not be able to find it on youtube directly so you need to access it through our trello common board because majority of the videos which are being recorded are unlisted okay so you can only get access to them through either our website hackway.in or through the trello cards where the videos are shared and available okay apart from that if you have any queries uh, after tomorrow's introduction meeting day after tomorrow you can join the meeting and you can have your general queries uh, make sure you do not bring any queries tomorrow tomorrow is only dedicated for interns introduction so you deliver your interns introduction and that's all nobody uh, we will not be taking any queries tomorrow okay just uh, you your name will be called mr yash chandrapadhyay is going to unmute you uh, the sequence will be followed on the basis of raise hands okay so as soon as you join tomorrow make sure you raise your hands first otherwise you will be your name will be called at the end or in the sequence of raise hands okay so make sure you join tomorrow early raise your hands first so that your introductions can be done as early as possible otherwise you have to sit up to the last okay so once this uh, tomorrow once the introduction is done we will be issuing your tasks and day after tomorrow onwards you can join the same meeting meet with yashchandra upadhyay if you are facing any operational issues speak with him and he will help you out as in he will communicate with us and with the system we will be communicating all that all the required information with you guys so yash i believe uh, we have already explained it twice and the rest the meeting recordings were already for the 16th feb batch was already circulated with them so they can have the reference and uh, tomorrow we'll have this introduction meeting so you can once you start this meeting now make sure you share the screen of interns introduction okay so that they can see while they are speaking okay so they can see what they need to speak in case if anyone is not prepared they can see what needs to be spoken on and they can explain it okay uh, yes sir uh, right okay guys so we see you tomorrow in the interns introduction meeting and day after tomorrow you can have your general queries with mr yash chandrapadhyay and you can see the presentations of the previous interns uh, who will be presenting on 3rd of march thank you and have a great day Thank you everyone. Now we will end the meet. Please join tomorrow for your intern introduction.